We've got a flash flood here over the Swamp Rabbit Trail. We've got a little whirlpool down there. That's a log, folks. Look at that. Must have come up and over. We've got a flash flood here over the Swamp Rabbit Trail. Remember, it only takes a couple inches of water to knock you off your feet. You don't want to be going over this. Your flash flood warning continues until 11 a.m. Our creeks and streams, Reedy River, continue to swell up to flood stage. Gizmo's back in the saddle. Figured that she needed some fresh air. Needs a little bit of a chase and that's it. Enjoying the new Dominator 4.2. Woke up this morning to flash flood warnings, thunder, severe thunderstorm warnings as well, and a tornado threat. I have activated flash flood mode and I'm working the Reedy River and I'm gonna check some of the rivers here around Greenville. Flow right down there, but the floodplain is filling up here in Greenville. A lot of that flow is all going toward the main channel. I'm along the Reedy River in the Greenville, South Carolina area where a flash flood warning continues until 11 a.m. You can see this river here is going right up to the bridge. This is the Reedy River here in North Greenville, South Carolina. Even little logs that are starting to go by. Flash flood warning was issued at 7.30 a.m. Flash flood warnings up and down this convective line and that's largely because the winds are parallel to the frontal boundary, southwest to northeast in all layers of the atmosphere from the surface all the way to aloft and that's contributing to these thunderstorms passing over the same areas, basically training over the same areas, dumping a ton of rainfall. And that's why we do have the flash flood warning that has been issued through 11 a.m. Look at that flow, everybody. Even a little bit of debris coming in here, beginning to swell up to the level of the bridges. Look at all that debris as well. You can even see a log right there. Definitely the water here is starting to rise up to the bridge. Flash flood warning continues in the Greenville area. right there is right over the river but this whole floodplain here is flooded after four inches of rain uh, fell here across upstate South Carolina including a couple severe th and that triggered a flash flood warning at 7 30 in the morning and now we're transitioning to a river flooding event but after about four inches of rainfall this is exactly what happens <laughs> 